big reshuffle for Liverpool. Joe Gomez starts with Joel Matip as the centre-backs. Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain starts with Naby Keita in midfield. Divock Origi is the lone striker. The Aston Villa team for this game. We put it up as a 5-2-3. It could be 3-4-3, couldn't it, if the wide players get forward from the back? Yeah, I think it's one of those. It could be anything the manager wants it to be. He has got some very talented lads out there, though. Really coordinated movement from Liverpool, and they're keeping the ball. Fabinho. Oh, saved by the goalkeeper at full stretch. He's looking for the cross. Able to make the interception. Trying to catch the other team out with a quick break here. Slipping it through. A real opening for him. A brilliant breakaway goal. Well, that was absolutely mesmerising the way they moved the ball forward so swiftly, so slickly. Well, it was a gift. Strikers dream about moments like this. A tap-in. Yes, yeah, not often that you do get what is literally an open goal. And he wasn't going to miss it. Nothing wrong with that tackle. In fact, it was a terrific effort. It's Origi. Origi! Very good stop here. And the referee spotted that deflection. He's pointed for the corner. James Milner. We're looking for a couple of killer passes here from the attacking team against defenders that are really earning their money. The whole team is defending. What an important goal this may well be. They're two ahead now, building a platform for victory. Well, some might say you'd prefer to score from 25 yards, but I wouldn't go along with that. This is all about instinct. Well, it's a goal worth replaying over and over again, isn't it? Positionally, he was top class today. There's still danger here after this half clearance. And now the shot! That's the right kind of football dive to turn the shot away. He's put in the corner. Well, the play is broken down now. Hit it hard, <laughs> but not very true. And it goes out from the header for a throw. And the referee has blown his whistle. It's 2-0, the final score. Well, in cup ties. Winning is all that matters, and they have won. Yeah, they've done the necessary. I think they just about deserved it. It was close at times, but, yeah, uh, winners here.